want to do any more? You want to show me a stall? Okay, let's do a power off stall. I have flight controls. So we'll go into slow flight with the um, full flaps. Well, 30 degrees of flaps, not 40. I'm going to go up to 3,000 feet out here. Nobody's around. And basically what we'll do is we'll configure the plane like we're going to land. We'll fly around for a minute, then I'll use that power out. And we'll do a nice gentle stall. down until we get the stall one horn, put 30 degrees in, make sure full forward, and carb heat in, start adding a little bit of power because I'm going to catch it right at the edge of that horn, it's still holding 3,000 feet in this heading. As I add power back in, you can feel on the controls I need to add a little right rudder, so with your feet up, we always are keeping our feet up there, unless I tell you otherwise. And cow flaps are open. Mass primer on and in lock. So that's 30 degrees of flaps. And what are we doing across the ground? 54 knots indicating 50 miles an hour. There's the horn. So right there. And we can fly around with that horn going off. Add a little bit of power to hold altitude. Alright, I'll turn that horn off right there about 49 miles an hour, 44 knots. Let's make open a right hand turn. So we're right here, borderline still holding 3,000 feet. I can climb, I can descend, I can, you know, I can't maneuver a whole lot because you're right here on the edge. If I really bank the plane over, I lose all that vertical lift and we will stall. there on the edge of the horn. I'll try to, try to trim it where I'm just out of it. That's straight. Left's clear. We'll come back to the left. Not a whole lot to it. So now, I'm going to pretend, okay, that we're lining up with the runway. There's our runway. Runway's made. I'm going to ease the power back to idle. And I'm going to fly this speed down for 100 feet. Far feet out. All right, here we are. We're flying to the runway. Runway's made. I got my hand on the throttle, ready to clear the car, car heat as well. All right, so now we round out. I'm going to bring the nose up to the horizon. Don't fight me too much on the rudder. You're loose over there. When you're feeling along, you're loose. There's the horn. I'm all the way back, and that's pretty much it. She's, we're in a fallen leaf. I've got no more back pressure to give. And that's, that's a, the buffeting. Like, we entered it so slowly, that's all we get. So I'll come out without even adding any power. I'll ease, ease the nose down, and I'll come back into one a little more abruptly. There we go. Break. Ease out. <laughs> Alright. So you notice I didn't slam the yoke full forward when it stalled. I just relieved a little pressure. Let that nose come down to create lift, and then power is necessary. I mean, they say full power, but you see we're still flying, airspeed's increasing, we're, we're holding our now 2,000 feet. I think we should probably hit, start heading back. Alright. You want me to fly for a minute or you want it back? Alright, look outside, put 